So these are the grade boundaries for the Edexcel IGCSE Foundation paper, but the new paper, the new 9 to 1 that started in the summer of 2018. Now what you'll see here, I've got, um, I've got the summer of 2018 papers 1F and 2F up here, uh, but I've also included the, um, the second set of papers that are produced by Edexcel for the regions. So where there's a time difference, they make sure that people in other parts of the world um, sit a separate paper. So this is just an opportunity to get our hands on more papers to practice, which are of the nine to one format. So basically from summer of 2018, we've got the 1F and 2F, which were the papers taken in the UK, and then um, a 1F and 2F, the papers taken in the regions. So um, as things stand, um, we're in April 2019, there's just going to be the four papers on the system. Uh, the January 2019 one papers, ni January 2019 papers are locked by Edexcel at the moment, so I won't be releasing answers to those until um, Edexcel have, um, have unlocked those. Now, the other thing to note, as you know, both the papers are calculator papers. They're both marked out of 100. This is the total mark that you needed to get out of 200 to get the grade boundaries. You will see some are in bold type. The level 4 and the level 1 are in bold type. So those, actually, they properly add up. 56 add 54 equals 110. 11 add 11 equals 22 and so on. But for the grades 5, 3 and 2, they are flexed a bit. So, um, so, so for example, to get a grade five in the summer of 2018, you needed to get 138 marks in total. So, not quite as many as what 70 add. Um, no, 70 add 68 are 138. But some, the, the, yeah, that one, for example, doesn't work. 68 add 69 doesn't add up to 138. So, where you get a contradiction like this, just make sure you got 138 marks over the two papers.